Hey everyone, so here I am doing exercise 7.6, fourth question. This is from class 6, fraction chapter. The question is, fill in the boxes. We have our three questions to solve here. The first one is, dash minus 5 upon 8 is equal to 1 upon 4. So we have to find out the blank over here. So I am going to just put a box, minus 5 upon 8 is equal to 1 upon 4. Now to solve this, either you can take here a variable or you can just keep it a blank like this. So I'm going to leave a blank like this. Now, since I want to find the blank, I, do, I want to transpose this minus 5 upon 8 to the other side. So whenever you're doing a transpose method, the signs will change. So here, uh, it's like I told you before, you can take it as x. So I'm going to take here x. So 1 upon 4 minus will become plus. So it will be 5 upon 8. Now. We cannot solve this further because we have a different, uh, like it's unlike fraction. So we're going to take a LCM of 4 and take so that be a like fraction and then we can go th do the addition. So LCM of 4 and 8 is 8. Now, for the first number, that is 1 upon 4, denominator is different, right? We have to make it same. So with 4, what we should multiply to get 8 in the denominator? So we have to multiply with 2. So multiply 2 in the numerator, denominator, we'll get 2 upon 8. Now let's start adding this. So x will be equal to for second number i'm not add, changing because already 8 is present in the denominator so we'll write 2 upon 8 plus 5 upon 8 so it's like a like fraction denominator will remain same which is 8 add the numerator that is 2 plus 5 which is 7 so the answer is 7 upon 8 we cannot cancel this further so the x value will be equal to 7 upon 8 so same thing goes with the second and third problem also so let's start with the second question so in second question we have again we have a blank so b problem b is blank or the box minus 1 upon 5 is equal to 1 upon 2 so it's similar to the first one again the same thing we're going to transpose minus 1 upon 5 to the other side so i'm going to keep a blank like this i'm not taking a variable this time so 1 upon 2 minus will become plus so plus 1 upon 5 Again, they are unlike fractions, so we have to make the denominator same to make them like fraction. So we'll take LCM of 2 and 5, which is 10. Now for the first number, which is 1 upon 2, we have to make a denominator 10, right? So with what we should multiply, so it's not 5, it's 10. So with uh, 2, what we should multiply to get 10? So we have to multiply 5, multiply the numerator also. We'll get 5 upon 10. Now for second number, which is 1 upon 5, same thing with 5, what we should multiply to get 10? So it is 2. So multiply 2 in the numerator, denominator, we'll get 2 upon 10. Now we're going to add these numbers. So 5 upon 10 plus 2 upon 10. Denominators are same. So we're going to write the same denominator, which is 10. And we're going to add the numerator, which is 5 plus 2. So 5 plus 2 upon 10. So here we're going to get 7 upon 10. So in place of blank, we'll get 7 upon 10. Or you can take a variable and you can solve this. The last question is, this is a different than first two problems. So in problem C, we have 1 upon 2 minus blank is equal to 1 upon 6. So let's write down the question first. So 1 upon 2 minus the blank is equal to 1 upon 6. Now, see, there are many ways of solving this. I'm going to transpose this box to the other side to avoid the negative sign. And I'm going to bring this 1 upon 6 to the this side, that is left hand side. I can transpose 1 upon 2 to the other side, but again the minus sign will be there with the box. So that's why to avoid that situation, I'm going to transpose a box. Okay, so it will be like minus box is equal to 1 upon 6 minus 1 upon this. This is one more way of solving this. But to avoid the negative sign, I'm going to transpose this blank to the other side and bring this 1 upon 6 to the left hand side. So, 1 upon 2, so we're going to bring 1 upon 6 to the other side, so a plus will become minus, so minus 1 upon 6 is equal to, this blank has a negative sign, when transpose this to the other side, it will become positive. So, number, whichever, whatever number is going to come, it will be positive. Now, denominators are not same, we'll take LCM of 2 and 6, which is 6. For the first number, 1 upon 2, we have to make denominator 6, so with that, we have to multiply 3. So, multiply 3 in the numerator, denominator will get 3 upon 6. Second number, we don't have to multiply because already 6 is present. So, we're going to subtract these two numbers. So, 3 upon 6 minus 1 upon 6 is equal to the blank. 
So the denominators are same. We are going to subtract the numerators. So the denominator will get 6. So 3 minus 1 is equal to the blank. You can take a variable there. So 3 minus 1 is 2. So 2 upon 6 is equal to blank. We can cancel the numbers. So 2 1s are and then 2 3s are 6. Try to bring this to the reduced form. So 1 upon 3 is equal to blank or the blank or the space where the answer has to come is 1 upon 3. So that's it. This was a simple problem. I hope it's clear. In case you have any questions or doubts, you can drop a comment below. And thank you so much for watching.